Carolina Gamecocks overcame an early deficit and rolled to a second national title in the past three seasons this afternoon in Cleveland. Our 70s sports director Pete Yanity is here with more. Pete, what a day we've had. Kelsey, impressive work by Dawn Staley's team. There they were, cutting down the nets in the aftermath of their triumph over the Iowa Hawkeyes, a third national title since 2017. And again, some early adversity, no trouble at all. And Todd Summers has the recap from Cleveland. In the game of basketball, it's all about matchups, whether it's a season opener or for a national championship. And for South Carolina, coming into its contest against Iowa, it was about their size and their depth, and both showed up big in the national championship game. After an 18-point first quarter from Iowa's Caitlin Clark builds the Hawkeyes' lead to seven after one, South Carolina outscores Iowa by 10 in the second quarter with freshman Tessa Johnson coming off the bench to score seven of her team-high 19 points in the quarter to help South Carolina lead by three at the break. Me and Lay were on the bench, obviously, in the beginning of the game, and no one was really attacking, and so we thought, like, that's her game. She attacks, like, she does it all. I attack when I need to attack. The third quarter was pretty impressive as well, as South Carolina pieces together an 11-0 run between quarters to lead by nine less than two minutes into the second half. And in the final frame, the Gamecocks' size inside was simply too much as South Carolina's Camilla Cardoso and Chloe Kitts combined for 27 rebounds and 26 points as South Carolina overpowers Iowa to win the game and a second national title in three years. Final score, 87-75. When you put so much work into something, how does it feel when you reach the ultimate goal? It just feels so crazy. This doesn't feel real. Like It does not feel like the championship. Like I just have no words. I'm just so happy. Revenge Tour is finally over. We've been working really hard since the beginning of the summer, and I'm just so proud of this team and proud of these coaches and our fans and our families. Just proud of everybody. At various points throughout the season, Dawn Staley said she didn't feel like this South Carolina team was under defeated because they played poor enough to lose several different games. But ultimately, South Carolina finishes 38 and 0. And this is one of the many rewards for the Gamecocks as they secure a third national championship in program history. In Cleveland, Todd Summers, 7 News Sports.